Kisai Governor Simbu Arati has sensationally claimed that the Directorate of Criminal Investigations officers in Kisai are planning to plant guns in his homes. Arati through his lawyers, alleged that Kisai DCI officers were planning to search Kisai and Nairobi residences over alleged illegal possession of firearms. This follows an incident on January 9, where unknown men began firing gunshots at Nyakumbni, South Mugirango constituency Arati was issuing bursaries, the gunshots started when the governor took over the podium to address the meeting attendees. Speaking after the incident Arati linked MP Sylvana Sosara to the incident. However, Osara distanced himself from the allegations accusing Arati of staging the incident to seek empathy. Speaking to the press at the DCI headquarters Nairobi the lawyers demanded Kisai DCI detectives be investigated adding that the officers were recorded issuing instructions that could put Arati's life in danger. The lawyers added they were eager to see what actions would be taken as Arati had made accusations to the DCI headquarters Nairobi about Kisai officers. A copy of that clip to the police also this morning and this afternoon, where an, a police officer, a CCIO in Kisi, is recorded giving instructions and giving insights into how uh, guns, uh, firearms, and other things are going to be planted on Governor Arati. Partly is to make sure that Governor Arati is not given the space to undertake his duties as uh, Governor of Kisi. This is a unique complaint. We, Governor Arati has lodged a complaint with the DCI against the DCI. So we want to see the action that they take. Because uh, the alternative is to take the law into our own hands. But as counsel for Governor Arati, we have lodged the complaint. They've assured us there'll be some action. So we went to await that action.